so you know what they say about stupid ideas. If it's Fox, they'll fuck it up with Fantastic Four. Cause it's not bad enough we got three terrible movies in a span of a decade. Oh no, no. No, no, no. No. No, we gotta, we gotta try again. Cause fuck it. Now most people that are subscribed to this channel, those to the podcast and stuff, you know, you, you guys probably know that my favorite comic book team of all time is the Fantastic Four. Absolutely love them. Love the comics, love the characters. And then you have the film versions, right? This is like when you go get a name brand cereal, but your mom's like, no, nah, you can't you can't get tricks. Tricks are like $3.99 a box. You're gonna you're gonna get trickies. Trickies are like 99 cents. They come, you know, three times as much in that bag, in that fucking ghetto bag. And sure, if you eat the entire bag, you're probably gonna go fucking blind. But you you're getting the trickies, so shut the fuck up, kid. That's the Fantastic Four movies, alright? They're the trickies of the fucking serial world. And even though I found, like, the 2000s ones mildly entertaining, they were mildly entertaining, they were dumb, entertaining trash, they were still bad films. But, let's, uh, for a second, let's just go back to the goddamn abomination that was the 20... What year are we in? 20, 2017? So 20, was it 2015 that Josh Trank's movie came out? Holy shit is that. That is something. That that fucking movie is something. But I mean, you know what's even worse? They've had three attempts in a decade. And their Rotten Tomato score combined. If you combine Fantastic Four, Rise of the Silver Surfer, and the fucking 2015 reboot, you know what you get? A score that's less than fucking Doctor Strange. That's how bad those fucking movies are perceived. They're, they're god-awful. I mean, you'd have to either be real high and shit yourself on set. Sorry, Kate Mara, had to drop that in there. Or you'd have to be some fucking idiot to want any more of these movies from Fox. But this past week, Simon Kimberg was asked about, uh, what's the future of the Fantastic Four? And he outright says exactly what we fucking know that Fox is thinking. He says, we haven't started talking about that. Of course you haven't. Of course you fucking haven't! You're trying to forget that those movies fucking exist. You're only gonna do it because you have the license and you don't want to give it back to Marvel. That's the only reason we're ever gonna get another movie from Fox. Oh, and believe this, we're getting another fucking Fantastic Four movie from Fox! I mean, this is like one of those things where you're like, alright, so, you know, you have, you, everybody has that stupid girl in their life that's so fucking stupid, right? She's like, listen, she comes home, and she's like, alright, so, wh wh why are you all black and blue? What happened? You're, you're just like, what the hell's wrong with you? And she's just like, well, you know, fucking, fucking uh, Slippy. I'm gonna call him Slippy, alright? Fucking Slippy over here, he's trying to put out his fucking rap album, right? So he beats her. And, and you're just like, well, that's like, what, the third, fourth time? Fourth time if we count the first time, which you don't count. That's Roger Corman, by the way. We don't count that one. But that was fucking Fox, too. So Slippy's like, yo, yo, home dog, yo. It's like, listen, listen, Slim Shady, all right? Shut the fuck up. We live in fucking 2017 now, okay? Stop acting with your ego. Take that fucking thing that you don't want. Clearly, you're just hanging on to it, and every time it tries to do something, you're just fucking beating it. And Slippy, you ship that the fuck back to Marvel, okay? You let it go back to its fucking parents, because nobody fucking wants it. Okay? It's so fucking damaged. At this point, if Marvel regained the Fantastic Four, not even they could fucking salvage anything for the next 15 years. But then Kimberg adds this. I think the truth is, we would not make another Fantastic Four movie until it was ready to be made. One of the lessons we learned on that movie, referencing Josh Trank's bomb in 2015, is that we want to make sure we get it 100% right. Because we will not get another chance with the fans. Fucking Slippy! You fucked up four times! Four fucking times! Okay? You failed enough! And the whole reason the last one exists is because you waited till the literal last fucking second to start production on it just so you could hang on to those rights. So don't feed us fans this bullshit you're gonna wait till it's right. No, you're not. You're gonna wait because it's a fucking jerk off contest that you just wanna go, <laughs> Marvel, we're not giving it back. We're just gonna ruin it. That's the whole fucking reason. So no, we don't want another fucking Fantastic Four movie from Fox. We don't want Fox touching anything from the Fantastic Four. But God knows they're going to. God fucking knows they're going to. Ah. <sighs>